Hey everyone, welcome back to IT Samurai Teacher. My name is Shih Abdul. And today I'm going to show you a IT gadget that I can read my NVMe drive. This one I uh, removed from my old laptop. So I want to read it. So I purchased this uh, SSK. This brand name is SSK. So this can read M.2 NVMe uh, drive. So it's very easy. This is the sleek design. You can see uh, what you need to do here. You just pull this open and put the NVMe card in here and put it back. USB-C cable and USB cable to your laptop or Raspberry Pi. Uh, the main purpose I purchased this to read the Raspberry Pi device because Raspberry Pi 5 is going to support for the booting SS uh, NVM drive. So I'm going to do this another video how to configure the Raspberry Pi NVM drive. So this one I can carry over to my office, my school and everywhere to read the files and copy the files. So this is a very handy tool if you really want to uh, get it. So it's very cheap. It's not that much, like 10 to 15 bucks. And uh, I'm gonna drive, uh, jump in, I'm gonna show you uh, inside and well, how you uh, connect this NVM drive. Okay, I'm going to open this. Open this side. Okay, we have a manual how to use this. I'm going to put that away. We have two uh, pads, and we have a USB C cable. We have some screws. And we have a USB to USB C, and these two ports USB C. So we have two uh, cables. Okay. Now it's the main part. Well, the finishing look is good. You can see the lock and unlock in here mm, you have a USB C port here so let's go ahead and see what's inside okay now what I'm going to do is I'm taking out you can see in here uh, you can push you can see a lock sign so it doesn't matter I mean just it keep open now I don't like one thing about this because so once you put this this is not like a plug and play now for me I want to uh, go back quickly copy files and remove it but for that it's not going to work like that so once you plug this uh, NVMe you need to put the uh, one screw in here uh, but I like like just plug maybe twist something and put the case and go back and copy in the files and put it out like remove like maybe two three nvm card reader in one but it takes some time so because you, once you put the nvme you need to put this screw so that's the only part i don't like it because it takes time it wastes my time because i want to do it quickly and 
quickly and possible to finish my my assignment like copying quickly and move on to the other one now this one make me slow down i know it's not a big deal that it's good to save this otherwise when you copying fast when you plug the USB-C cable probably you will get disconnection so that's not good so you need to have this one uh, so within five minutes you able to put that screw back in uh, you don't need to use a screwdriver or anything and put this one the only thing i don't like it's not i know there's a sign but it's not going to lock anything just like this so that's the only uh, bad thing about this case that i mean it's coming out i mean, I, I can't lock maybe i'm doing wrong let me change the side me yeah so it's still that side but when you it's coming out link so so that's the part i don't like this case but for the budget wise it's not a big deal okay you can you can put the, in the both sideways so probably i'm doing oh yeah okay now it's got locked so so you need to put in the correct way now this is a sign in here so i put it this way and with the sign now it's locked now it's not going now i need to press this unlock side then it will come out i see i see maybe i did wrong that's good to know so now you have this side and like this put it like that now it's not coming out my bad but anyways we figured this out now when you put your USB-C cable now you can copy your files to your machine and that's all for this video and uh, this device uh, like actually i was checking the internet it was let me check again so it was 18 dollars this is not 10 to 15 dollars is 18 dollars 18.99 usd uh, so this is uh, close to 19 bucks i'm not sure if it worth it or not but you can copy your nvme files and carry over uh, but the only downside for me personally i like to have plug and play that i don't need to put the screw because i want to quickly uh, quickly take this one out and put another one because i have this screw it make me slow down but if you want to keep it like if you don't need to uh take it out all the time you know it's good it's good this is like a like a secure the nvm card and you can copy your files thank you for watching this video if you like give me a thumbs up i will uh, create more videos about the uh, nvm cards for with the raspberry pi stuff so see you that see you on my next video